Hello everyone, I'm LPS Okamoka Productions, and first of all, this is my first video, welcome to my channel. I will be posting mostly LPS videos, LPS music videos, everything LPS, and first to just get started, I just wanted to post a video about me showing some LPS customs. I only have 10 that I've made, and they're all pretty bad, so that's a thing. And this is not my mascot, but she is one of my mascots. Her name is Diane. She will be seen on this channel. And my mascot is actually coming in the mail. And if you can tell, I use aftermarket replicas or fake LPS because let's just be honest they're way more cheaper and and they just look and when I was okay I used to collect when I was six or seven and then my mom once I got back into LPS tube I asked my mom where they were she said she threw them out so um, from then on, I started collecting off of eBay. And that's it. Some are real, some aren't, but I actually don't care because it looks just like the real one. I don't even think you could tell on camera. But that's enough of me. Let's get started. First, I'm going to show the one that I got off of eBay from a seller I don't remember. But it was $2. And I just loved it so much. It actually looked pretty cute in the pictures. So, I'm going to be showing that one right now, and it's not mine, so if you're watching this video somehow, thank you for making this custom, and thank you for letting me purchase it. So, this is the custom that I bought off of eBay. I did not make this, but I've decided to name her Luna, because she's dark, and I love the little spots. I love them, and I love the stripes on the back of her ears. They just look amazing. And whoever made this, thank you so much for letting me purchase it. This was two, about $2.50 on eBay. I saw it. It's a real LPS. Just painted with nail polish. Every LPS custom that you make, you should feel proud of it. No matter if it's bad, no matter if it's good, you'll always improve. That's what I've learned, and that's what I'm going to keep doing. So, I'm going to show the next one. This is... Well, oh my god. I don't have tape at the time, so my background is falling. So, the next one I'm going to show is two I made at the same time. They're both bad. They were the first customs I ever made. So, yeah. Are you ready for a monstrosity? Here I am. So, I know it's terrible, I know it's terrible, I know it's terrible. I made this like two or three years ago once I started collecting back up. And I'm sorry for my nails, they, they were terrible, but I bite them. But anyways, so this is a cat. It's a fake LPS, like the legitimately the fake rubber plastic ones that you see on ebay for like 20 for like two dollars i just bought them to like practice and you see his head is squishy it's a fake so his name is tyler and these two things on the back of him on the back of his tail are eraser are eraser buds and he controls lightning i tried to do this like superhero thing but it never really worked out so yeah and the next one I made, I made right after him, her name is, um, I think her, I named her Angelica, or Angelic, or Angelic, I think, I'm just gonna call it, get out, I'm just gonna call her Angelic, because, 
so this is uh, aftermarket replica of the fuzzy one. That's why it's rubbed on some spots. And I just glued some. I'm um, in the fake LBS pot. I just found um one of those um, fireflies, I think. So I just glued her wings, uh, glued their wings on there. And yeah, this is Angelica. When I first read it, I thought these things were the best, but then they're they're just so terrible. On to my next one is still terrible, and that's when I stopped, I took a break on LPS Customs and I started up. Okay, so this is an actual fake LPS, and I know it's terrible. This is a fake LPS, I'm out of the fake pack, it's squishy, squishy, squishy. And I named her Stitches, because, and I mod podged it and it rubbed and it's terrible. I kind of like her because I do animation with her, but do not look at my channel. Actually, I'm not telling you guys my channel. So yeah, and this is her, and moving on to the next one before my camera battery dies once again because of my dollar store batteries. This one I made for my sister and her girlfriend. It's a LGBTQ L. B GQ. I think that's it. If it's not, I'm very sorry. LGBTQ cow. I made it for her and her girlfriend once they both found each other. Pink represents lesbians. The blue represents um gay. And the purple represents transgender. And the brown represents basically straight. So I have nothing against it, but I am straight. I have nothing against it. I actually think my sister and her girlfriend are pretty are a pretty cute couple. So yeah, this is the LGBTQ girl. I actually like her very much. And okay, this one is so bad. Like I'm actually scared to show it. It's terrible. It's so bad. Like oh, oh my gosh. Look at this. Look at this monstrosity! Don't worry, this is not a real collie, it's a fake one. Uh, like a real fake one. Its head is too strong, I can't even push that, but it's a fake one. So, yeah, I, this one, I basically really was really frustrated, frustrated when making this. I legitimately dropped it in dirt after the paint was over it actually looked pretty good but then i had to paint it a second time and yeah this happened and it's terrible and i probably will remake some of these so please do not steal my designs but you can go based off of them like i don't care actually i don't care you could just you could just take her you just take all my designs i don't really care so yeah moving on to the next one so here's this one that my grandma actually loves very much i named her wolfie she's basically this pink demon that just pops up randomly in places and yeah i actually really like this one i just used with a sponge i was just testing it out with different paint colors and stuff and yeah or, I sometimes call her Zombie. Zombie. Her names are Foxy and Zombie. 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 <laughs> so, yeah. That's basically it about this one. So, on to the next one. This one I painted for my grandma. She loves clowns. Like, I don't know a word about it. She just loves clowns. So I had a duplicate of this horse, so I just painted it for her, and it's actually a zombie horse because it's, it was, like, the, her came, she came with, like, holes in her face, so it's a zombie circus horse, and I really love her saddle, and she just has blue markings everywhere. As I was saying before, I was really interrupted by my camera dying, 
Her eyebrows are blue. She has blue markings everywhere. So yeah, I just want to get this over it before my camera dies again. So, moving on to the next one. So, I named this one Coconut. And I actually love her. And her paint is chipped, I know. On her eye. And I'm sorry for that. But my camera's about to die. So, I need to go to the last one really quickly. So, this is my last custom. I did this really quickly. Before my camera dies again. So, um, I got a big bunny package from eBay. And this one came without a body. So, this was the first time I messed with clay. And my little nephew kept breaking off her tail. So, it's not painted yet. And I actually like this one very much. It's my favorite out of all my customs. Obviously. And I named her, um, Hot. I named her Hot, um, Hot Coco. Because she looks like Hot Coco. And this, this little gem on the top of her forehead, if you know Pokemon, Sun and Moon, Litten. Yeah, I based it off of that. Uh, based off of Litten's head, so, yeah. I really like this one. It's a mermaid bunny thingy. So, yeah. So, I hope you guys enjoyed this video of me just introducing myself to YouTube and knowing my customs so yeah guys thank you for watching like comment and subscribe <laughs> like comment and subscribe and i'll see you in the next video peace peace love love ciao ciao bye bye